Hello, I'm Matthew. I'm Matthew O in the chat, at Matthew O Trailer on Twitter. Uh, I just wanted to thank Andrew and the BBT mods for recognizing my trade as trade of the week. I really appreciate that. Um, I, I always knew about day trading. I knew it was a profession that people did as a career. I knew they made money from it consistently. So it always interested me because you, you didn't really have a boss you had to report to. You, have to. you didn't have to go in. You could basically work your own hours. I really liked how, how much money you're making is reflected on how well you're doing. Like how hard you're working. I really like that about it. Um, so in July 2019, I found Andrew's book on Amazon. And I read it and I loved it. I loved how honest he was about it. Saying that it's really hard work. Saying it could be the most difficult thing you attempt to do in your life. Because I, I think I'm a hard worker. So I, I, wanted, to, I wanted to take the challenge. Um... The book is amazing. He tells you everything you need to know. Um, where to start, patterns, brokers, how it all works, psychology. It's just, it's a great book. And um, so a month later, in August 2019, I gathered a membership to the website. I was paying monthly. And I, I would just watch the videos all day. I'd watch them trade in the morning. Um, I would just try to learn as much as I could, and then I got the DOS simulator for three months, and, um, the first month I was just kind of messing around, trying to figure out how it all worked, the hotkeys, uh, what, uh, what everything does, uh, I was trying to learn the level two for a while, and, um, yeah, then about a month into the simulator, I started, like, trading for real, not, like, for real, but, like, trading, like, um, setups. I was mainly trading um, the five minute opening range breakout and double tops and bottoms. And uh, I was doing I was doing all right with it. I wasn't really um, being green every day yet, obviously, but it was interesting. I, I liked I liked doing it. And um, so then in January, after my three months was up, January twenty twenty, I I got a lifetime membership and I. Um, I started taking it a lot more seriously, CLO, so no. I um I started taking it a lot more seriously. I was getting up every single day now. I was studying all day. Um yeah. Um I was starting to be profitable in the simulator in about February and so I started thinking, oh if I keep doing this well maybe I should go live. So I keep I keep at it. My three months DOS is coming up, expiring, and um, I'm still doing well in the simulator. So I'm like, oh, I'll just I'll just go live. But I wasn't really trading. Like I didn't really have like a playbook. I was just I wasn't really trading that many setups that I knew worked. I was just kind of, oh, I'll go along here when I think it's gonna go higher, or I'll short this when I think it's gonna when I think it's gonna sell off. So I I get. I go live um, early April with CMEG, and it was just a mistake. I was I had no trade book, no playbook. Um, I wasn't using hard stops. I did I I didn't could not deal with the with sitting in the trade emotionally when I took it. I just it was a mess. I ended up um, losing almost half my account. I would have some great trades, but I, I wasn't really managing risk properly, so I would have a great trade, and then I would just like lose all of it the next day or a few days later or whatever. So then in uh, late June 2020, I went back to Sim, try to perfect my trading, and um, that's when I started the Find My Edge. I was I was really studying the five minute opening range breakout. Um, I noticed that a lot of times when it gaps up a lot, it'll pull back to VWAP on low volume, and then you can go long at VWAP, and then you can catch the five minute orb like even before it happens. So that that's what I was really studying, and that's my trade of the week on PLO is a is a low volume pullback at the open, and. Um, so yeah, I've just I've just been trading that every morning. 
that's what I trade in the morning. I always look for that at the open. And um, if I don't make my goal, or if it do, if I don't find one that really suits my rules, I'll try to find a break of high of day or a double top or bottom. But that's my main my main strategy. So that's that's what I've been doing uh, in October and September. I'm not profitable yet. I don't think I'm a I'm not a profitable trader. My account is definitely not green yet, but um, I'm I'm doing a lot better than I was the first time I went live in April. I'm definitely nowhere near losing 50% of my account. I'm about breaking even, so I imagine it's only up from here. I've been thinking about going back to sim and making my low volume pullback strategy even better. But yeah, that's where I'm at. Uh, the community is great, the webinars are great, the videos, the forums, so many, all your questions can be answered on the forums or in the education center on the website. Um, I always ask questions on Twitter when I, when I have a question, people are always very nice, they tell me. It's, it's just the best community, I don't think any other community can give you even a fraction of what um, Bearable Traders gives you. It's worth every penny if you put in the time. The effort, the work, it's worth every penny. Just no one even compares. And I'm proud to be part of the BBT community and family. Thank you.